Hello everyone. Welcome to Pathology Collection. So, today we will study about the grossing of penile tumor. Whenever we will get the specimen of a penis, we will check for the orientation and we will take the measurement of the whole specimen in all the possible three dimensions. After documenting the measurement of the specimen, we will identify the tumor and we will document it as a, either it is infiltrative type or proliferative type, ulceroproliferative type and along with that we will mention about the numbers of the tumor, either it is multiple or you multiple or a single like unifocal or multifocal there are two type of panectomy as we know total panectomy and partial panectomy, panectomy. specimen are of two type total panectomy in whole the penis will be there and the partial panectomy as our case is of partial panectomy penis. we'll have to identify and take the measurement of the shaft and glands prepuce that will help us to check the tumor extent the tumor is extend to the glands or it is involving the prepuce or the penile urethra to identify and orient the penile me urethral meatus we'll try to put a probe inside it that will help in the orientation also and this is a case of a penile tumor so in this case resection margin play a important role for the surgeon like resection margin either it is free from the tumor or it is involved this this was the R case of partial penectomy and this is the urethral meatus here I have kept a probe inside it to orient the specimen and after and in this section you can see here these cassette 1 and 2 are of section with the tumor here it is the ulcerated growth over the glans penis now I mentioned you about the resection margins in the cassette 3 4 5 here I have written it as a corporal spongiation because this is the corporal margin and this is the urethral margin in this section urethral meatus is here along with that in any case of carcinoma the surgeons will give us the regional lymph nodes here gnd of left and right side were there and these all are the regional lymph nodes of the in case of any regional lymph nodes, we'll have to mention about the number of lymph nodes we have got. Along with the size of the largest node, we have to mention it. If we see any gross involvement in that, we have to document it about. And this is all about the penile tumor grossing. At the end of the grossing, it's our job to mention the total number of sections taken. And if we are taking different color of cassette in our uh, department, then we'll have to mention about the color of the cassette used in this case, the particular case. We'll mention about the color of the cassette along with the total number of sections. This is all about the grossing of penile tumor. Stay tuned and keep studying. Thank you.